Hi, my name is Lavish Kumar. In this video, we will learn how to import mass product images in Knob Commerce. For this tutorial, we are using version 4.1. Knob Commerce certainly makes it very easy to manage your product catalog. No more manual update is needed for you to keep product images up to date. If your product images are changing all the time, you can simply make use of the import and export feature in product catalog area and administration section in Knob Commerce to import your product images easily in one step. Let me show you how you can do that. Let's go to the dashboard section. And if you go to catalog and products. And here you can see all the list of your product catalog. And I'm sure you are aware that you can technically add or edit or delete product images by going into each product. So if for an instance, if you're looking to add or remove images for this product, you can simply click on the edit button and go to the pictures tab. And here you can manage all your pictures. But of course, if you have thousands of products in your Knob Commerce site, then it can be quite difficult to manage product images. But Knob Commerce offers an important export feature by which you can do a mass import for all the product images. Let me show you how you can do that. So what I'm going to do is instead of doing all products, I will select two random products. For an instance, let's select Apple iCam and let's select this necklace. Okay. So now I'm going to export these two products. You can export by all found and you can export by selected. In this case, I have selected two products and I'm going to export to Excel and it's going to give me an option to save the file. And I'm going to save this as products file okay so now that we have the file let's open this Excel file and here you can see we have all the information for these two products you have the name short description full description prices and everything so for images just go at the end and here you can see picture one and picture two and it's giving the location where the images being saved right now. So if you if you go into the product pages for these two products, so I'll go to the camera and photos and here I will select Apple iCam and here you can see currently we have just one image on this product detail page. Just like that I will go into a second product and here I will select the necklace product that we have exported. And here you can see we have one image right now. Okay. And this column name is basically giving us the path of these two images. All you have to do is if you have more than one picture, if you would like to add more picture or replace the pictures, you can simply give a path in this file and import it back. So let me give you an example. I have two images right here for Apple, like Cam and Art Pendant. I'm going to copy this path and I will plug it in this. Okay. And I will take the image name and I will add it here. Okay, so just make sure you have the correct format for image file. In this case, I have the JPEG file, so I'm going to add .jpg. And just like that, I will add a second image. And from here, I will take the file name and add it here. So in this example, as you can see, I have not changed anything in picture one. What I'm doing is doing a mass import for two products in which case I'm adding a second picture or image for these two products. And nothing is changed. You can change 
you can make other changes as well but in this example I'm just adding a new picture to show you how you can do the mass import and I'm going to save this file and close it okay so now all you have to do is click on the import button click browse and here you can select your product file I've selected the file and now I will click on import from Excel button and as soon as you click it the import process will start and it will process here you can see products have have been imported successfully okay so now if I go to the public store here you can see the product image there's only one image okay so now on the product page if I refresh the page I should be able to see two images and you can see the second image was added successfully and here your customers can see more than one images now and at the same time since we added two products if we go into the product 2 product detail page and refresh it now if you scroll down we have the second picture added successfully on this page so there you have it this is how you can import mass product images in Knob Commerce. Now it's time for us to wrap up this tutorial video. Hope this was helpful. This video is brought to you by Knob Commerce, open source shopping car. Thank you.